if they come to take your car back. Uh, no, why'd you say that? My car. My mummy's in trouble, Brad. Oh, that's my problem, Hal. Well, I need to go to Fargo's and see if she's all right. Right, so you just thought you'd hotwire a car, did no, you? No, you're the one stupid enough to leave your keys in the ignition. Well, let me drive, at least. Oh, it's just typical, isn't it? You always want to be my knight in shining armour. Fine. Fine, you drive, but you won't be getting anywhere fast. doesn't even work properly anyway. Well, if you've got something to say about my mum, why don't you say it to me? She shouldn't be allowed out on her own. I don't know what you're talking about. The woman is off her head. Yeah. Oh, not stay. in my restaurant, you don't. <sighs> but why don't you go and sit down? I suggest you take your mother, settle up and leave my establishment. Listen, listen, listen. Can we just give me five minutes, please? Miss Jean, she's um. She's a little sensitive. Since its refurbishment, this restaurant has been awarded four stars in the Walford Cassette Review. We're renowned for our modern take on traditional classics. This is not an audition room for the Jeremy Kyle show. Is uh, Sir intended on sitting there all evening? Uh, no, 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 I'm just waiting. Yeah. The mother-in-law, I presume? Uh, yeah, yeah, she is, yeah. I shouldn't worry. Every family's got one. Mine took to hiding out in a wheelie bin. Bradley, Mum's going to come home with us. OK. Thank you. Uh, well, I didn't really do anything. <laughs> Mum thinks the world of you, you know. Anyway, uh, you take Mum to the car and i just got to do something. Yeah, come on, Jean. I think I've had too much wine, Stacey. My head feels ever so light. Well, we're almost home. I'm gonna be sick. Uh, no, not in my new car, you're not. I can't open the windows. There's no handle. Yeah, well, that's because there is some... Oh, I feel better now. 